And after morning, I'm out and about and up. And I've actually found Higgett. It's actually open. In the previous video, it was actually closed, but now he's open. So let's go and see him. I just come to Chris Higgett's arcade. I just thought I'd film. I've seen on YouTube, I've seen on TikTok. It looks small on video, but actually it's not that big. Uh, it's it's kind of big. Got the 40 pence machine. Got the machines there. Got the Simpsons. Jewel in the Crown. But happy days. Got Casper. It's a boot you all. Deal or no deal. You've got Adam's family, you've got the Simpsons one over there as well. You've got a Thunderball. You've got a two penny arcade there. Big breakfast. Got the big breakfast one. Oh, Vegas. Thank you very much. Probably the worst impression of Elvis ever. Las Vegas. Ottoman. Hawkberry. Mega Steak. Dracula. Got the Dracula one there. Yeah, Monopoly, Monopoly as well. This is on Dale Street, by the way. Dale Street, Blackpool. Let's put you on. Sorry about the noise in the background, but they're, they're the machines. That's a camera crew that was it on Channel 5, 2007. Sadly, that bloke there has passed away now. God rest his soul. Him there. That lad there has passed away now. God rest his soul. If you ever watch, if you ever go on YouTube, you can watch the entire. Well, I mean, it was about five, only five episodes made. If I try and remember, I'll put the link in the video so you can watch it. You've got the big, big bandit there. Yeah. Crazy fruits. Yeah, and how are you doing, Chris? Yeah, I'm good, I'm good. You all right? Yeah. I'll give you in a second, guys. I'll be going to catch up here, okay? Foxhole Market, you've got two of it. Got two of it, Bingo. It's always worth a look. And here it's Bingo. And you got Happy Days just over there. The back entrance of Happy Days. Why, hey, buddy lad! It's out and about with Rob from the North East. Away, man! They come here to visit me in some sunny town of Blackpool to see the famous one pound burger. So, what part of the North East are you from, Rob? I'm from Newcastle, but I live in a place called Crampton in Northumberland. Never heard of, I'm out of Newcastle. Away, man! Peace, pudding, and all that kind of stuff. So, don't forget, guys, if you like this video, hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to come down here to the world famous one pound burger. I've seen it on TV, I've seen it on TikTok, I've seen it on YouTube. I'm actually cooking burgers at the moment. Here we go. This is where the magic is done. As I said, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. See you later, guys. As you can see, we're at Happy Days. And we're just uh, down for food. We've 
just met the lovely Pete and he's a nice gentleman. And I met the dogs as well, Coco, Chanel and the others. Don't ask us the other dog names because I haven't got a clue. Pete's over there in the back room if you can see him. Right in the middle of the grey head shop. You come in to see Jays and order your food. The food's of disordered food, so I'll show you what it looks like when it comes. Just showing you the food. The friend's got scab and chips. And I've got fish and chips in Happy Days. Just been to Happy Days Arcades and had some food as you could as you could see. And the food was absolutely lovely. Ten out of ten. My mate enjoyed his scampi chips, I enjoyed my fish and chips. Ten out of ten, it was absolutely nice. We've just passed the uh, tower and we're going this way. We're going to water pier, there's another pier up here. We've got a wedding chapel over there. If we want to get married. We've got papas over there. Which I, I've been told it's really nice but a bit pricey. Papas over there. We've got Blackpool City Centre that way. I'm just trying to cross the road. I went to see Rick from Beyond the Edge YouTube channel, but I didn't film that. We had a, we had a game on the horse race, but we didn't win out. But it was the fun, it was fun though. Fun do, doing it. So look up Beyond the Edge on YouTube. Was it one and off here? On the north pier, I can see the water still calm. And it looks to me the water's going out because the water was up here this morning, but it looks like to me the water's going out. There's some interesting facts about the north pier. A step back so you can see it. If you want to pause it and read it, you can. I don't know if I've got it all on, but I have. He's all at the theatre, if you like him or not. Take or leave him. People like him, people don't. It's up to you. There's Sooty. History of the North Pier. I'll scroll down gently, slowly, so you can read it. Just walking along the North Pier. They've put new boards, they've put new boards down. New, new walkway. As you can see, you can tell the difference between that, that side and that side. There's a Blackpool Tower from the North Pier. You've got Central Pier over there. This is the North Pier as we know.
Back up here, Mr. Oh, yeah. Open it, 1863. Yes, I was going to say something else there. Eh? There's a metropole, the cenotaph. And if you go that way, it takes you to Fleetwood. It takes you to Fleetwood that way. Ah, the water looks like it's going out. You can tell where it's been, where the water has been and it's coming out. You've got Lake District, it's over there somewhere, and you've got wheels over there. But you can see them on a good day. Oh, how is his corporate? Died in 1989. That was easy for me to say. That's a look, John Longhorn Theatre over there. As you can see, we're on Aberdeen Street, Blackpool. Got the church there and the church there. Used to be a church, but now it's a nursery. And you've got the Baptist Church over there. That one there. Hi, we went to see Chris Higgett, as you've seen on the video. And he's a lovely bloke. We met Pete as well, from Happy Days. If you, if you haven't already looked up his YouTube channel, Happy Days. Happy Days is spoke with a Z on the end. Just in case you're uh, wondering, it'll be on the edge as well as Rick. I think that used to be the job centre. That's, that used to be the job centre. That building there, till, I think it's closed down now. Street tattoo shop on the right. Just trying to see what street we're in. It's probably still the same street, Abaddon Street. I would have presumed. Yeah, it is. I think. Ah, oh, it is. We're on the same street. Back in the centre of Blackpool where all the shops are. Station pub. Station pub. You've got the winter gardens over there as you've seen it before. The winter gardens there. I've come in from a different angle. You've got the uh, famous telephone boxes. And if you go that way, it takes you to the North Pier. That way. And then you've got the Premier Inn over there. In the centre of Blackpool, where if you want to call it the centre of Blackpool. And there's the Winter Gardens up close and personal with the Winter Gardens. I stumbled across this artwork down this down, down here. You've got the butterflies, the usual suspects. Got the Queen, rest in peace. And this one here, Bad Santa, 
I was just passing, I thought, oh, I'll get this on film. Whoever's done it, has done a good job. So pity there's a, uh, pity there's a stupid pin on the way. Nice artwork. As you can see, we're back at set up here. Blackpool. We're just uh, on York Street and we're heading back to the car. We're beating the Higgins. And we did buy a, I did buy a pound burger. I haven't tried it yet, but because I will once we get to the car. Got Bearstow Street up here on the left. By by up for a bear, something like that. Some of characters. Got the hotels down there, bed and breakfasts. Obviously you got Mark Kelly's there to the right, just there. And the sea, it's over there. You can see we're just uh, on the way back to the car. You've got the lens down cuff, which is shot, looks like it's shot at the minute, Dale Street. So Dale Street runs from here all the way down there to where Higgins is. And obviously it's a one way street. So if you're in Blackpool and you see a yellow transit van, that's Higgins van. Blackpool football grounds over there, as you've seen, as you've seen when we first did the video. And Satan said us, bought the store, something for the weekend, sir, so choose, sir, something for the weekend. Leafham Park Hotel. All rooms are on street. Just thought I'd show you this again. I think it's this one or the one over. I think it's the one over. The one over there I showed you. Because that's why we need to go up here and turn left. I don't know what they're doing here. Building something? I don't know. Got the karaoke bar over there. Got the Beatles bar over there. Love, love me too. I have been in, has anyone been in there? If it's any good. You can just see them up there. Just going to turn left here. Got the 
Port Bruce and Charles Wager. This must be the head office of the Blackpool Transport. Welcome to Rigby Road. Because I know they're making a new uh, carriage or whatever you want to call it for the trams. But this is a cold one. But whether this is going to get moved or off board offices, I don't know. Can't get that all in if I can. Obviously, you got home parkings over there. You got the Victory Hotel, a bar, or whatever one is called. It. It's probably a hotel. That's a nice Honda Civic. Trans Blackpool Transport Rugby Road. All visitors must be sat in at the reception. Sorry about the wind, but I just want to film this bus. Electric buses are coming to soon at Blackpool in 2024. If you come up here, you see Frank and Penny's in the origin. Apparently, they're going to knock all them down. The walk on the wild side, it's done a video over there. On YouTube, if you haven't heard of Walk on the Wild Side, please uh, look them up and have us see these videos. And if you do like these videos, tell them out and about Riff Rob sent you. It was great meeting Chris Chris Seggett. And I met Howard's Howard's where's Bingo. I brought that calls the numbers. I met him twice but I only filled it the second the first time. Second time I didn't film it. And obviously I've seen Chris the second time, but I didn't film that either, I only filmed him when I first met him. Up here. Pigeons! I'm sorry if the video is a bit shaky. I need to buy a uh, in gimbal or whatever that stops your stops your camera from shaking. I want to look into it and try and get one if I can. I, like I say in my previous video, I had a, I've got the camera, but for some reason the battery was flat. But I did for somehow I was I wasn't charged up properly. Got like the bus step over there. And then you got Blackpool ground over there, as you seen in the first video. Just pound into here. And that's Blackpool Tower. As you can see, the famous one pound burger from Chris Ricketts. I've got onions on mine and red, uh, red sauce. There's, there's other sauces available if you want. Can't you believe that was a pound? And Chris Hickett is a lovely, lovely bloke. I met Pete as well. He's a lovely bloke. And Rick from Beyond the Edge. So if you want to follow Rick Beyond the Edge on YouTube. Uh, Pete's Happy Days with a Z. And Chris Hickett. It's also got a YouTube, YouTube video. The Daddy the Virgin. So something like that. He did tell us what it was, but I am subscribed to their channels. I want to eat this burger. I want to tell you what it what it tastes like and if I like it or not. I probably will like it, but here we go. I've just ate the pound burger and it was absolutely delicious. I give it a ten and a ten plus. It was really really nice. For a pound, you can't go wrong for a quid. So if there was five of you, that's five burgers, that's a fiver. 
That's cheap as out. Cheap as chips.